Yes, it's still Metro File. Welcome back. If you've just joined, then you have missed more than half of the show already. And I'm very sad. But let's end with a service of songs and a night of tributes where a committee of corporate friends decided to celebrate late Deacon Gamaliel of Fori Shenere on Nosodi. <laughs> Deacon Gamelil of Orishaneri on Nosode was best known as one of Nigeria's top boardroom gurus. So it came as no surprise that a committee of corporate friends decided to celebrate him with a service of songs and a night of tributes. As expected, it was a night of tributes from every well-placed Nigerian in the corporate world. I just want to eulogize or celebrate a life like that of our immediate past portion, Solo and Chairman, Governing Council of the University, late Deacon of Orisene Re Onosodi Oefa. It is hard to eulogize any man, how much harder to do so for a luminary whose contributions to our university and indeed Nigeria cannot be quantified. I will not delve on, on his earlier days, but I will go straight to his impact on education and in particular University of Lagos. And the council, senate, staff, and students of the University of Lagos would like to join Mrs. Onosode as a Nosode and other members of the Nosode family in celebrating the departure of our former Pro Chancellor who served our university from 2009 to 2013. I don't want to run anybody else down, but I've had bosses much later, you know, that, that I should remember, and I can't remember this level of detail. So it was not how long, it was how well. So my message for the family, therefore, is that Deacon Onosade has not died. What he stood for is alive. And, it's, and many of my colleagues describe the same thing I, I've described. So that while grieving that we lost a patriarch, I think you should be happy and proud for what he did, for the lives he touched, for the careers he helped mold and the standards that he set. I don't want to repeat what others have said about integrity, about punctuality and so on. Let's just agree that we lost a gentleman and a scholar. The service included special rendition of songs from the choir. <laughs>
and also a Bible reading by his son, Dr. Chris Onosode. I will come again and receive you to myself, that where I am, there you may be also. And where I go, you know, and the way, you know. Amen. Followed by a choral performance. The son of the late Gamile Lonosode, Eze, gave a vote of thanks on behalf of the whole family. We should try to learn practical lessons from all these testimonies and uh, tributes we've heard tonight. We shouldn't listen to them as mere stories, but try to see how we can apply them in our own daily lives. Anyway, I'm not here to preach, so I'm going to say thank you very much, very, very much to of uh, corporate friends that have put this beautiful, beautiful program together. I must say, I came here a bit cynical tonight, you know, because of the time uh, constraints that this program was hardly put together. Speaking at the event, the Chief Executive Officer of the Nigeria Stock Exchange, Oscar Oyama and Albert Okumagba, President and Chairman of Council of the Chartered Institute of Stockbrokers, described the late technocrat as a man of integrity. has always made himself available uh, to share his world of knowledge and experience about the industry, and most importantly, to share um, his integrity, uh, which really is the watchword of the market, integrity. The King Commander and also the, is such an unusual man in uh, usual Nigeria. He's called Mr. Integrity, and that shows in the way he lived his life, the way he walked, and the way he passed on. Deacon Gamela of Orishaneri, Onosode, worked in both private and public sectors. He was a former presidential candidate for the All Nigeria People's Party. He founded the Good News Baptist Church in 1984 with thousands of members. Deacon Gamela Onosode passed on September the 29th at the age of 82. Again, may his gentle soul continue to rest in perfect peace. And to all he left behind, may you find solace in the fact that he lived very well. And of course, he was loved by many. Well, it's on that note, I end the show today. Thank you so much for being a part of it. If you missed anything or you just would like to watch past editions of Metrofile, remember you can go to a website and that's at channelstv.com via a YouTube channel. You can watch all you want to watch there and make sure you enjoy the rest of your weekend. Always remember that the most important thing is to take life as it comes. Just try your very best to enjoy yourself. Be happy. I mean, that's all that matters. I'll catch you again soon, but until then, have yourself a wonderful time. I'm Anne Mwawadu.